Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to trade options on Schwab in 2024. So in this video or today, we're going to explore or delve into the world of options trading. And of course, Schwab is a well-known brokerage platform, offers a robust use of tools for and resources, of course, for options traders, whether you're new to the options trading or looking to expand your trading strategy. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you'll need to go and, of course, access the options trading on Schwab. To do so, go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, it could be any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, just go to this URL section and make sure to enter here, schwab.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, you should be taken to the home screen or main screen of Schwab website right away. So if you have an account, make sure to enter your credentials here and click on login. And if you don't have an account, click on open a new account and make sure to choose the brokerage and trading option to start using, of course, or to start trading with the option trading. So of course, here an example, if you go to account products, you'll be able to see like on trading, swap trading powered by uh, Ameritrade, uh, Think or Swim as an example, if you care or if you want to trade on with Think or Swim, platform overview, education support, order execution, and research. So you'll be able to do all of that on with uh, on, of course, all, all of that trading on Schwab if you want to. So what you'll need to do, of course, is go to the trading uh, powered by Ameritrade, or you can even go and see the uh, platform overview as an example. So there are there's an like an app for it on desktop and a mobile app and even on web. So you'll be able to log in on the web or go as an example, click on login now. You'll be able to log in on the web. You'll be able to go and create an account or log in into your phone or even uh, download the desktop app and start from there. So you'll have now to go and access the option trading on Schwab. And as we said, Schwab is using the app, which is Think or Swim. As you can see for think or swim platform so if you want to access any like trading options example if we go here and go and open that or that or that it will all take you to this as you can see think or swim platform where you should go and download this as an app or use it on the web or downloads on your phone as you can see here it's going to be the same and here of course just to compare to compare the platforms and open or go and download whatever suits you or start using whatever suits you so basically, for me, I my account got deactivated on Schwab. So to give you more visuals, I'll try to look online. Example: so trading options. So options on Schwab. Okay, not like that. So yeah, as example, and yeah, let's see this. We can watch like a small video by them, but of course, I'm not watching the video how to trade options in here and we can see all of that so as you can see here the option trade they'll just tell you so why are op what are options is some just uncover more about options you can see from contacts uh, contracts basic to goal based strategies you can learn more about it why swap for options explore our option tools resources and support and how to get started with option trading discover the steps that you need to know to get started with that so of course you can learn more about it if you don't want to read any other information on the page you can click in here and start as you can see you can apply for option approval and check your option approval or even open an account first of all to do so for how to trade of course option you'll hear you'll have first of all to determine your objective income generation hedging or speculation and then you'll have first of all or second of all to search for option trade ideas so of course you have uh, whether you are already an underlying security selected or want to find out why uh, that fits of course your needs there are a wide range of criteria to help you evaluate potential trade ideas that match your strategies such as price volume implied volatility sector and more and of course option changes on Schwab. the option chain gives you a quick overview of the market or four options on underlying stocks and you can see trading volume 
price changes and uh, shaded areas that indicates in the money options so basically you'll find yourself on a place like this and you'll be able to view uh, like puts or calls whatever suits you you can see you can those filters will help you identify which option you want to start with and as you can see those are just some filters do you want to uh, do the option call or put and you can choose which expiration days of course in days and strike the shown and etc and of course here you have option change in statistics and on think or swim desktop if you want to download it of course as you can see view statistics uh, statistics like uh, put call ratio and iv percent uh, to determine your strategy and use the sizal index to help identify an option activities in this uh, unusual high or low so you can learn more about uh, option statistics on think or swim and you can analyze your ideas as an example or the ideas you'll be able to argue options reports on swamp and analyze sap on think or swim web and you'll be able to all put place your option trade so to do so as an example it's going to be something like that you'll be able to do as you can see more than one if you want to so here you'll find expiration days strike price the type the action you'll have to enter the amount that you want to buy and a lot of other stuff as you can see option trade build their own swap and you can even trade tickets on uh, think or swim mobile other than that you can manage your position as an example so if you bought an option depending on what price of the underlying assets you may decide to sell the option before it expired or exercise the option and buy or sell the underlying security you might also decide to let the option expire worthless if you sold an option you could choose to close the position by buying the option back or do nothing and let the option expire worthless the option may also be exercised by the buyer require you to buy or sell the underlying security and to help you make decisions on how the, to best manage your position, it's wise to keep an eye on the key information such as market event, markets events, company news, price changes, uh, dividends, uh, unrealized profit slash loss, and date to expiration. So alerts on swap platform and monitor tab on think a swarm desktop. And yeah, I guess like that. So of course, once you manage uh, everything, you will be good to go. So you can monitor and manage your position, of course. And yeah, I guess that article was a good thing. It will show us visuals. It gives us more details and it's, it completes everything for us. So there you have it. You successfully learned how to trade options on Schwab in 2024. Options trading presents exciting opportunities for traders to capitalize on markets movements and implement diverse trading strategies. So remember to continue learning and practicing to enhance your option trading skills and happy trading on Trump. And if you have any question or there's a specific topic that you'd like me to cover in the next tutorial, just drop it down in the comment section and I'll try to do it as soon as possible. And if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below, subscribe to our channel for more helpful tutorials like this one. So thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next video. So goodbye.